for a fourth time, a record breaking she, fourth is it time. Today? No, oh, no, no. I'm so excited. No, a, to him today. A record breaking Woo! fourth time and uh, first ever consecutive wakes of the back to back weeks. No, no, no. West. Been waiting. Hold on, hold on. Let, let me eat first. Let me eat first. Now, Kanye West has been on a rampage this week doing interviews, media press, and what have you. Because, you know, and he hasn't been in and the media everywhere for the past know, like, right? year. And he's still complaining about corporations and, you know, trying to own own businesses. Like, we we get it already. He's pushing but, on buttons. The last two shows he was on, first of all, he was on Breakfast Club, and he went on to make a big spiel about why he left Nike, and, and he was saying how Nike was saying how they weren't going to give him royalties off the of Yeezys. And I'm not mad at Nike for, for not doing that, because at the end of the day, the, the, the Air Yeezy was not a shoe that was of his own original design. There were different parts of that shoe that belonged to other Nike shoes. Like, literally, the bottom of the sole says Jordan. I know. And they, got, know. And they took it from the Jordan 3 I know. sneaker. I know. So that's the main reason why they couldn't give him royalties off of it, because they had to give the other people royalties off of it. That's why they gave him a large lump sum. Why do you care about on, 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 They gave him a large lump sum settlement of $40 million, okay? You know what he said in response to that? I have to take care of my family. Nigga, you hold are, on. Hold on. Hold Nigga, on. Hold on. You are, hold on. Hold on. Oh Nigga, my gosh. Kanye West, please. You are worth one hundred million dollars off of music, off We're of not touring, about his wife. off of everything else that you do. You have enough money to feed five families for the rest of your life. This okay? guy came out of and not to mention, he said he needs you to take already have a wife who's still capitalizing off of her sex tape fame. And who is what almost have you. as rich as him, or if not richer I than him? Exactly. Which is crazy. Now that was what set me off. What set me off? Is when this guy had the audacity to go on Sway in the morning and try to G-check Sway on his own show. Now Sway is one of the most humblest people that you'll ever meet in the media industry. So what does Sway do? Sway puts him in his place like a little boy who just shat his pants. He said, why are you yelling in the mic? Why are you yelling in the mic? Don't come to me on my show trying to sun me. This is my show. Get your shit Get together. It, Sway. And you know Kanye did? Kanye cowered like a little boy and said, I'm sorry, Sway. I'm sorry, Sway. I'm sorry, Sway. <laughs> You Kanye right. West, I tried not to give you the wanks of the week this week, but you tried my hand. My cup runneth over. I'm so sick and tired of you complaining about Walmart being, Walmart wanting, wanting to have your own Walmart, wanting to be your own businessman. We get that already. But you need to learn a little something called classic etiquette. You need to learn how to communicate Don't even people. say that. You know his mom and, taught that shit. He just forgot it. And, well, you need to reteach yourself that shit. And you're not gonna, you're not gonna do it by marrying a hoe who was known off of being a Billy Warmer off a freak, uh, off a damn sex tape. Kanye West, you're in the wings of the week. I have nothing Ooh. further to say. Jay Cream, does Ooh. this man deserve wings of the week, not only for a second week in a row, but for the fourth time in cool radio history? Of course! <laughs> Let's drop that shit real quick. Go ahead, Jay. You've been waiting. I'm done with Kanye. That was the Go first ahead. week I really enjoyed that, of course. Like, I leaned into that shit. We watched Kanye, that. I love you. I love you like a forgotten brother. I love you, Kanye. I love every album except for this shit ass album we just brought out. It was horrible. But that's not why I'm mad, okay, Kanye? <laughs> Kanye, the thing about Kanye is I have mixed feelings, okay? I've listened to a lot of Kanye, whether it was Charlemagne, Sway. I've taken a lot of Kanye interviews. And, like, I agree with some of his points about the corporations. I agree with the fact of what he's saying with the fashion industry, where he's saying how there's five major fashion companies that own all the fashion companies and they're all Jewish and they're all white. And he does not want to come out with a small urban label like Rockefeller or something like that that's gonna be only sold to an urban market. He wants to be the person who owns his own company who comes out with a huger label. And I understand when he said it with Charlemagne when he was talking about why can't I own my own, my own, my own fashion corporation and why can't I do that? Why do I have to set on something smaller? I get that point. But Kanye, you gotta understand this, man. When you go on every single radio show in New York and you keep on complaining, then you keep on complaining and bitching and bitching about the same thing, no one's gonna care about it, Kanye. Nobody cares anymore because it's like you're whining about it now. So no one gives a shit.